Uh, one of the things that, uh, that I get to do, which is kind of an unusual uh, task, I guess, for an organist anymore, is I get to accompany silent movies. And now I do this at a couple of different places. Actually, one of the venues is here. Uh, I'll be here with uh, um, Rudolph Valentino in The Eagle. Uh, that'll be Tuesday, I think it's April 16th, I think, but it's whatever the Tuesday that's really close to the 16th of April. Uh, we'll actually, uh, uh, we'll fly the console down to the other end of the room. This has a, uh, a ground effect machine that uh, uses an air cushion to lift it off the floor and we can actually fly it around to various places in the room. And so we'll move it down there, we'll bring the movie screen down and we'll be uh, showing the, uh, the Eagle uh, with a score that I actually wrote for it that's out on DVD now. Uh, it was reissued by the folks at Alpha Video in Philly. Anyhow, all that nonsense aside, uh, I'm going to test your film music IQ. How many of you have ever watched cartoons on a Saturday morning? Be honest. Yes, that's good. Well, excellent. Uh, that's where a lot of people got their, their musical background from. There was a marvelous man named Carl Stalling who did the music for the Warner Brothers folks. Uh, for 20 years, he turned out one comedy film, uh, they were short, of course, seven minutes long, but he turned out one film a week from the composition of the music to recording with the Warner Brothers 70 piece symphony orchestra all in a week's time. He did that for 20 years, week in, week out. Brilliant, brilliant man. But he set a standard for for mood music. Uh, he learned it while he was playing four silent movies at a theater out in Kansas City. Actually, as did uh, Mr. DuPont's personal organist, Furman Swinnon. He accompanied uh, films up at the Rialto and the uh, Rivoli theaters in New York City. And uh, he was known for being just brilliant at improvisation. Anyway, I've talked enough. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to play a couple samples of music let just an imaginary film run in your mind and just tell me, you don't have to give me a movie, just tell me who the characters are that are involved in these scenes. I'm going to hand register this just so I don't run into a mysterious problem. Earlier this afternoon, this is a very complex piece of electrical equipment as you can imagine. And earlier this afternoon while I was doing this, I inadvertently dialed my sister in Washington State. <laughs> so just bear with me for another moment. There we go. I think we're just about set. Okay, here's the first of the samples. Uh, or to scare the audience more likely. So anyhow, uh, here 
here is just a little locomotive going to come down the tracks momentarily. First, the whistle.